All right, welcome back. Got some work to do. I'm going to restock a little bit here. Mm, sure. And put, I should put that slug away, I think. Um, I need rods for sure. Let's get like three stacks. Let's grab some rotors and whatever else I'm producing. Let's see if I can grab a few of these out of here. I think I need a few. Oh my gosh, 44 is crazy to have already. Makes me very happy. Topped off the rotor stack. Topped off that. I think we're good. Cable. Oh, I need. I want to bring some a little bit of copper sheets because I think there's something I can grab. Oh my goodness. So I've got some copper sheets in storage, which should be enough. And then hopefully that's enough to do everything that I need to. Oh, here. Copper sheets here. I'll just grab this. Oh my gosh, look at that. I mean, how would this... wasn't... I mean, I just built that, right? Feels like... I haven't, like, been leaving the game running or anything. This was the save that was immediately at the end of the last one. I'm just going to hit a few of these as I go if I find something good. Wow, I had some wood on me. Like, a stack. Who's attacking me? Don't even see it. Right there. This is going to be good to pick up as well. Why do they run the other way? Okay. That was a miss. Lot of whifferoonies there. Whoa. Oh, there was another one. I just wish these guys gave more than one. Like everything else gives more than one, I think. Oh my gosh, another two. That not hit me. Matrix Matrix evaded that. Give me that blue slug. It's a nice group of wood here. Boom! 39 wood, I'll take it. Alright, so there's something else I'm looking for before I go back. Maybe after I go. Yeah, let's do it after. I want to get started on this right away, and then we'll work on the rest of this. Oh, let's see what we can do here. Nice. Starting to get the range and timing on that. Be good. Getting attacked by something else. Oh, up there. Mercer Sphere. Sure, let's get the Mercer Sphere while we're here. Very nice. I'm going to get hit by these, but it's okay. The parachute is weird. You see that? I didn't even jump. It just lifted me up here, which is nice. Has no song, only echoes, but it is part of a river. 
Light is the effigy, avoid the windows. Attention, your brain's operations are outside typical parameters. Time spent daydreaming will be deducted from your sustenance budget. Uh, yikes. Oh boy. Okay. I mean, like, those take two hits, too. Like, the hogs, but they give two remains. I don't know. The big tree is probably not worth a ton. Yeah, I mean, a huge tree like that should be worth more. Come on, now. Okay, I mean, this should probably be enough biomass. I just want to restock the biomass I have set up there. a lot of those other enemies have respawned. Your iron next to all that coal just screams steel factory to me. There's another spot that we could do a steel factory at, but that seems like a better one. If I can find coal power somewhere else, which I think I did stumble on something that could be much better for coal power, so we'll find out. Is this tree cut? There's no way too big, right? Oh. A lot of enemies. And these take one hit. Oh, they only give one remain, though. Oh my gosh. So many of them. Still more? Okay, that was gnarly. Seven. Still producing amazing, amazing stuff. See how it's doing. And I need to expand it a bit. But the fact that, ooh, it's getting, it's finally starting to run out. That's awesome. Okay, so first thing I need to do here is I want to run all this stuff, oh gosh, it's full, to an awesome sink. And I think the awesome sink is going to take too much power. It might shut this thing down. How much power does it take? Does it say 30? Yeah. I need a dedicated biomass burner just for this. So we're going to have to uh, redo this power stuff as well. So I think what I'm going to do is build three of them. And just have a little biomass burner farm here. Why is that not going to go? Oh, is it because of this thing under here? Oh, come on.
More enemies. I can miss all of these. There were more. I definitely saw more. How do you like it? How do you like it? More, more, more. Okay. So now I'll put this back here, storage container. I'm just gonna hook um, right into this. With these three. And let's craft up some stuff. Just a bit to get it started. Once these turn green, we can get rid of this one. Okay, now, what I want to do here is... I want to run all of this stuff into there. I think I have a little bit of research to do with this. I mean, I, I will need to do more stuff with this in the future, but for right now I don't really need it for anything. I'm not going to be ready until way past steel, so... What I'm going to do is merge them together. mark to them right into there and I'm gonna switch this one over to silica does this mean I can get a third because 22.5 this is pure so I can run a lot actually throw another one down another constructor put a merger here That's terrible. Uh, that's supposed to be a splitter anyway. Make it all mark two. And run power over to here. this silica get another storage container here uh, that's is that in front even no that's showing there we go feed that into there as well Beautiful. So every silica is going to give me 12 coupons. So we're going to be generating, you know, a good amount per minute. 
If I can actually just dispose of this, it's going to actually make it even better. Just dispose of this quartz. Ooh, I don't know what I just destroyed. Or I think I just missed the button. I can always come back and work on this later. So now we're really just going to be pumping out pure silica. Silly silica. And... By the way, I can craft all of this stuff into um, all of this this loot I picked up. Just throw it into uh, alien DNA and throw that in as well. Get a bunch more coupons. This is not going to last forever, but it should last for enough hours to hopefully come back at some point and run the real power to it. Now, obviously, yeah, I could run a power line all the way here. I just don't like to because I don't... It's going to create a messy power system that's not really thought out. It's just trying to activate this. But obviously, the benefit of doing this stuff here before expanding is huge, so... Even though it's a little wonky to do it this way, I think that this is actually pretty optimal. I really want to get started on coupons because they're fantastic. Hey, there we go. We ran out of leaves too. Good. The only thing left is mycelia. Oh my gosh, I got so much mycelia. But this produces really quickly, fortunately. through that hundred quick. I mean, look, we almost filled up that container. This is nuts. All right, so now we take this, all this stuff and make it into alien DNA. I don't need the protein for anything desperately, so might as well get a few coupons out of this. Probably close to 10 coupons out of this to start. Maybe less, maybe eight, I don't know. I know it starts, you only need a thousand, but then it goes to two thousand. It kind of increases, but it doesn't increase like one thousand every time or anything. So scaling is weird. I don't know how to calculate it. Boom. Okay. Now. First of all, I want to see how much this is producing per minute. There's the flat rate, 2400 per minute. That's beautiful. So now all I have to all I have to do is just throw these in right here. And let them pump through. They're going to come little by little, but that's okay. And yeah, they're just going to start crushing it. DNA points, there we go. DNA points are going to start coming in. Yeah, buddy. Alright, that's good. I'm, I'm going to leave it at that. I don't want to spend too much time admiring my work there. Because we got work to do. I'm going to go collect a couple more... I do have some space, that's good. I'm going to go collect a couple more things that I know the location of. Things which I know the location of. I 
And then it might be on to Caterium Research. Like right now I'm very satisfied with it, how everything is producing. And it's a good time to start developing some other research. I guess expanding the base out to do that. Caterium would be the closest. Sulfur is a little far out. Eh, I don't need to fight these guys anymore. Ain't nobody got time for that. That didn't grow back yet. Mm good. Mm good. Okay, so uh, actually, is this a cave here, by the way? It looks like a little tiny cave. Did that drop down into the same stuff? I don't want to check. <laughs> I'm scared. This is what I'm looking for, this wreck right here. I believe it's guarded by some spitters, yep. I actually had been testing a strategy where I farmed this one as well at the beginning, like I did with the other two. There's even like two more I can try to farm, but it ended up really just kind of being diminished, diminishing returns, and I found the most optimal thing was just to do that original one. This one takes, yeah, some of those modular frames I worked so hard to set up. Damaged hard drive successfully acquired. Rotors, let's All go. Engineers are contractually obliged to preserve and secure any recovery. All right, now we got another one up here. MAM, which may result in benefits to the Fixit mission. Speculation as to why there are crashed freighters in your Fixit designated zone is Grab slugs and stuff. Well, in your contract. you know, slugs aren't really that valuable, actually. I don't use them that much. They're going to be valuable if I ever really want to. I don't know how I'll ever get to this point, but truly maximize every little bit of everything. Because you want to put those on all the mines, right? Alright, we got another one up here. Down that way is sulfur, actually. Yeah, this has got one of these scary pigs. Slightly less scary when you do that. I mean, I'm telling you, I came here right at the beginning of the game and dealt with all this. And what I did is I built my hub over there and then just died over and over again to collect everything. Steel pipe is massive encased industrial beams. Steel pipe is actually really huge to get this early. Same with staters. Well, staters actually, they do unlock research. It's not as important though, but here, okay. That's why I brought the copper sheets. Anything else? Okie dokie. Lemon squeezy. Oh, more steel pipes. Yeah, cut great amount of steel pipes there. Um, hmm. So there's another one I'm going to go for, but I'm thinking about sulfur in, in between. I could at least grab sulfur. Like a couple stacks to do the research with. I believe it's over here. Wait, what's up here? Poisony stuff. Okay, maybe I do go down there. Um, hug over here. Does this drop down? This might go right down to sulfur. Um, okay. Is sulfur? Yes. Okay, good. And a lot of little stingers here for sure. Look at those. Just waiting for me to screw up. 
even more than we saw before. I saw three and now there's four. Oh my gosh. That's it. Beautiful. Okay, so what I'm going to do is build... Um, let's build an equipment workshop. Portable miner. I don't have space for a portable miner. Uh, let's throw this grass away. And this wood away. Maybe one of these. We'll throw it here. And we'll just throw it down. And now I'm going to get a MAM going right here as well. And we're looking at sulfur. Interesting that when you grab it out of there, it didn't trigger the dialogue, unless I already missed it. This unknown chemical element. Okay, so here's the key now, is before I can go any further, I actually need uh, charcoal as well. So I'm going to make one more portable miner. And go take care of that. I'm trying to find the best route from there to sulfur, and I think it's this way, through this water. Sulfur to coal. Although, there's poison there. So I need to go through that. I think I could just go up left here and I don't have to deal with the poison. Pretty sure. Yeah. Look at that giant hunk of quartz. Oh, it's just a little one on top, actually. And now we got some scary stuff up here. That hurt. Wow, that was a blast, huh? Nice. And nice. Yep, just aim above. Oh, I missed that one. I used to think you had to hit the actual yoke. Then I realized it doesn't matter where you hit. Oh, there's a Mercer Sphere there. Just take our damage, like, men. Alright, so this is the route, I think, because I think this leads right into the Sulfur. Or, sorry, the Coal, since we already got Sulfur. I think right down here is Coal. Yep. Yup, 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 yup. There's a lot more enemies down here, more Mercer Sphere... I was going to say more Mercer Spheres, and then I realized there's only one, so I ended up saying it weird. Okay. Okay. Now I do the same thing down here that I did before. Throw this on. Throw it right here. Well, that's doing its thing, I'll go fight. I think there's another big boy over here. Yeah, another big spitter. He's guarding the Mercer Sphere. Oh, and a... Uh, oh my gosh, and a piggy. That worked well. A lot of spitter remains. Holy mackerel. Okay, let's see how we're doing. Why am I picking up grass? Go outside. Touch grass. Let's get closer to 100 and then I can deal with it. Here, I'll just do this while I'm doing it. Just help it out a little bit. Coal is not a researchable one. It's part of um, 
part of steel production. All right, 99, 100, let's go. Should be plenty now. Yeah, this route's not bad. This route's not bad for carrying sulfur. I could, I probably will do my sulfur -y production stuff over there. I might even do my quartz production and my um, sand production as well, because there's another entrance over there, like I said before. It's just guarded by, uh, well, it's got poison, and it's also got uh, a rock, so you have to have dynamite, which is what we're working on now. Nobilisks or whatever they call them in this game. Nobelisks. Okay, so now grab this out and do our research right there oh I need 50 for that I believe I have enough for 50 though research completed black powder recipe unlocked I do new sulfur research available I'm producing like a mofo right now Yeah, whatever. Compacted coal is fine. Research I feel like it's almost a waste of that. That's a waste of a uh, <laughs> waste of some research there. Um, sulfur. This one I need fifty of those. So do I have enough? Make fifty. I don't have any sulfur. This fuel upgrade can be used in coal-powered generators and vehicles. There we go. Cool, I can make 50 quite easily. This all just lines up quite well. Just like that. Go back over. Detonator. This one, I wish I had that. Not quite. And basic Can't do anything else here. Most obstacles can be yeah, everything else is pretty noblest. moot here, but I do want to actually create one of these noblest detonators if possible. Rock. I have to have an object scanner and 10 steel beams. I have steel beams back at the thing. And Q on the universal detonator. That's easy money. If you do not recall the order in which you deployed the noblesks, remember Fixit does not take responsibility for any harm caused due to human error, even if those errors are genetic. And then let's create 25 Noblesks, so I'll actually I'll be able to start blowing stuff up. We still have plenty of pipe. I think there's another set of pipe that I can grab as well, so not that worried about the pipe. Cool! That's exactly what I wanted to do. We'll go back and make a Noblest detonator, and then we'll be able to blow stuff up. So if we get a rock that's in the way of building, we can blow it up. We don't like how someone's looking at us. We'll blow them up. I think that was a pretty worthwhile detour, huh? Finish all the sulfur research without even really setting up production for it. I mean, later I can. This 25 will carry for quite a while. Um, but I do need it to get inside of this cave over here. Just don't have any steel beams on me. So the other cave entrance that I was mentioning is actually down here with the, this coal. 
It's right back there. No, right back there. Right back somewhere. Right back there. And it's guarded. We got a bunch of stingers over there. He got attacked by another piggy. We're going to need some... Maybe a little bit of this, because we got to... I think this one requires power to open, so I think I have to build like four of those... Uh, Conductor things or uh, power generators. It's up here or down there. Uh, I think it's up here and over here. Maybe down this hill. Or I'm a dum dum. There it is. Nice. That, one, that spitter was just confused. This is like a medium one, huh? It's not like the crazy ones, but... Oh no! I ran out. Uh-oh. That's really bad. I need... It's an equipment workshop. Right away. Hide behind it. Craft rebar. Let's go. We're hiding. I can see him. He's looking at me, but he turned around. Yeah, the rebar gun is fantastic. My brother is playing with me, and he just hates using guns in games. And I'm trying to explain it to him. I don't want to push him, because I want him to enjoy the game. But he's like, I'm not going to use it. I'm like, okay. That's fine. But the default weapon is terrible, and you don't get the sword until quite a bit later into steel. Oh, they got, got this little buggies off. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, hit him! There, oh my god. That actually was close to death there. That was way closer than it should have been. Because I screwed up. Is there a steel beam over here? There's pipes. Nice. No steel beam. It's fine. It's fine, just fine. Um, let's go ahead and turn all this stuff into protein. Get a little bit of space to work with. With which to work. Ooh, that was a close one. So I need 100 megawatts, which means I need four. <laughs> oh my gosh, is this enough for that other research? No, I'm at 42. I needed 50 for that other research. More staters. Okay. One, two, three, four. Get them all hooked up. Get up to this and we're gonna try let's see i just need the slightest bit of power i think i can i'll just do one gotta waste one of these there we go now divide it into four like that i'm gonna get a immediate fuse blown but that's okay throw all four of these in then fuse back on. Go grab this as fast as we can. Boom. And boom. Nice. I don't think I burned much there. Like one of each. One from each. Like four total. Okay. So I think I got everything I need here. Go back to town. 
That was a good haul. Very productive one. We got our... The biggest thing was getting the coupons rolling with a crazy strong strategy, which is just a ton of silica pumping out. Should work quite well for quite a long time. This is a pure... There's a bunch of pure iron and a pure concrete here. This might be where I do my advanced iron setup. Like, once I get done with... Once I get coal power set up, then I might revisit iron and really make a super strong factory for it. That might also be when I start doing Mercer Sphere Ender Chests or whatever. Yeah, I mean, the, getting these legs so early is beautiful. There's another strategy to getting them really early, by the way, and it's in the first biome. If you go to the purple area... In the first biome, you'll actually have a chance, because when you cut those ones, those weird tubes, they also give you silica. So if you get enough quartz just from those random nodes to get the first two research things done, which I think is like 30 total quartz, on the right side, get the silica unlocked, then you can unlock the legs and the 200 for the expanded inventory as well. It's awesome. Okay, so I want to build another... Um, another one of these awesome sinks. I don't really care right now where. We're gonna fix it up later. I'm gonna put an awesome... We're missing screws. Put an awesome shop over there as well. And the reason why is because you have to have an awesome sink to print out... Coupons. You can't print them out from the shop. And it has to be powered to grab those out. So I'm going to go ahead and use it, though, but I'll use it for something else. I'm going to use it for dropping off extra junk, alien DNA, whatever. So I'm going to go ahead and get some alien DNA out of all the stuff that I picked up. Thirty-three of it. Okay. Wait, what is going on? Oh, didn't see it. There we go. Oh my gosh, we're already up to that many coupons. That's ridiculous this early. Holy cow. That's actually fantastic. <clears throat> so it looks like we're producing 2,400 points per minute with our current setup, which is insane. I mean, that's a coupon a minute, essentially, right now. I'm going to print these out because um, I want to spend them. There's quite a few things on my shopping list right now. First thing is architecture. This is the first purchase you should always make is a factory ladder. It's going to let you climb up anywhere. It's going to make it so you don't need jump pads. You don't need power. You just build it up. Some other things here that are helpful for structural things, but I want to get a few of these first. Stairs are good. I don't know about that stuff. Inverted ramps that might help. Customizer is fun. Oh, this material, concrete and asphalt, is good. Some of these pathways are great if you want to start building that out. I'm at 38 already. Wow, that went quick, huh? Let me take this one off. 36. Let me double check. Is there anything else I desperately need? These signs are really good. We got the quartz stuff going. Oh, conveyor stuff. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We need the conveyor stuff right now. I'm going to take a few of these off. Let me take this half foundation inverted ramp off. And we're going to add this 
this and this. Wall mounts and ceiling mounts. Now we're at 33. Wall power outlets. There we go. That's a perfect use of 36, I think. There we go. All fix-it vetted Beautiful. materials are tested for toxins, hallucinogens, and other biologically adverse effects. Pioneers are advised not to immerse themselves in these materials and not to lick, eat, breathe in, or otherwise consume them. So another thing I want to do, I'm not there yet, but I realize I'm going to be there and it's not going to be too far off. I want to build an assembler um, that's going to make 50 smart plating so that I can instantly get past that tier. So I don't really care where, I'm just going to throw it out here. Nothing's going to feed into it. Just going to be smart plating. So let's see what we got as far as wiring. Sure, why not? Okay, so I need to put... I'm just going to put 50 in. And I need to grab 50 rotors. I used a lot of rotors for random stuff, huh? Research and whatnot. There we go. Thirty-six. There we go. All right, so this is just gonna do its thing. I could put slug juice in if I want to speed it up. Don't really care because I'm not in a hurry right now. Our max consumption is four seventeen. Capacity is five forty. We are starting to get into scary territory here. Uh, maybe we can consider building this. Let's see, do we start going for coal power right now? I actually kind of want to do the unlocks before I do coal power. You know what I want to do is build another row. And maybe do a bit more farming. I also wanted to rebuild iron. Okay, we got 13 minutes. Can I rebuild the iron? I can. I can definitely do that in 13 minutes. Okay. We're going to rebuild iron. We're going to just make it look a little bit cleaner. It's good. just going to be four smelters. It's very easy. And I need... How much space do I need? Four smelters. Middle. Middle. And then these two can be next to each other because it's going to be iron. Structures right next door. These two are fine how they are. Oh, I built these all backwards. That's not how you do it. Somebody caught that, right? Yeah, that's right. Is that in that? That's not how I built it. are just going to be running right into these and I accidentally overbuilt here so I'll do this and then four constructors yeah I've got this one down so you know so easily at this point I've done it so many times don't get cocky okay and then splitters on these Is that the middle? It's middle. It's here. It's here. It's here. It's here. It's here. There. And iron plate. Iron plate. Iron rod. Iron rod. Iron rod, iron 
rod. Merger. Facing forward. Splitter. Constructor. Let me move this up to the middle, just to make it look a little bit nicer. And I can move the merger to the middle as well. So I left two spaces, so might as well. Merger, right there, make it look nice. Yeah, that's as middle as it gets. And then splitter, middle, right there is as middle as it gets, yeah. Merge around these two right here. Also in the middle. There. Merge around these two as well. Okay. Merger here. And not a lot of space here. So let's actually do, let's run these over here. We'll put our three um, story, and eh, eh, let's wire it first, let's wire it first. Get it going, get it rolling first. And then I'll worry about the storage because everything's good needs to get wired up and going and then we oh we need to get the okay destroy everything here destroy destroy oh my gosh no i don't want that stuff on the ground no dismantle crates oh crap that's going to be so many dismantle crates let me try filling these guys up here no one clipped that one. Oh, this was not supposed to run to those. No, this was supposed to run just up here, and then this was supposed to run to those. Run up to here. Here. Okay. And here. I think that's running now. Let's see what's missing on the hookups here. Oh, it's supposed to have iron ore. Not I oh the iron ingots are supposed to go in here. Boom. 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 Okay, let's go. They're destroying more of this. Silly little factory. Terrible, ugly factory. 
It's going to take a while to clean up this mess, actually, because a lot of containers are full. Okay, we got dismantle chest dropping, which is not what I want. I hate dismantle chests. So let's see, I, sh I have enough to feed these guys now. Feed me, Seymour, feed me. No. I have enough to top these ones off as well. There we go. Now we can clean up our dismantle crates. More dismantle crates. Oh my gosh, that's why. <laughs> That is why. Okay, I got an idea. Here, take it. Oh, that's not powered anymore. Oh, crap. Okay. I lost the power connection. Go. Here, have some of that, too. Here, have some of that, too. Let me store some stuff to put a little bit of space. This is... Not good. You can throw some of this in here. Why'd I give up the mycelia? Interesting, we actually ran out of biofuel. That's at 200. That's at 163. And I'm worried about this one. Show it. 110. Okay, we're okay. Uh, but it seems like I'm going to need to do another biofuel run, unfortunately. Or I rush for coal power. But I think I'm okay with taking my time on coal power. Here, do this. Oh, I need iron plate. Here, do this. Just feed into there so I can start dumping stuff. Get rid of all these dismantle crates. I do not want dismantle crates to start causing problems. Get these running over where they should be. Okay. I need iron rods. Okay, whoops. I think they're producing.
Okay, I think it's all hooked up now. That one's running over there. I feel like I should get some redundancy with this connection here because I actually don't like how that's connected. I want to kind of create a main line. Like maybe here to there. Or actually here to here. I don't know what the main line is. We're going to figure it out though. That'll allow me to clean up some of these. Uh, not this one. I think I can clean up this one though. Yep, those are still producing. Good. Oh! <laughs> Come on, dude. Some on me. Pull these back up. Let's go. Now we can figure out our storage situation here. So I think I put the first one just straight lined up with this up here maybe and I just put the other two here and then we figure out routing for the other two this one goes straight in so we're gonna run up to here here Get that curve back no that looks good good now this one we're gonna do the same thing but bend it right to here and then right there there we go all right I did it just past the wire. Um, do I have dismantle? This is going to dismantle crate, right? No, it didn't. That did. Okay. These screws are just a nightmare to get into that thing. But I'm going to do it. That'll work. Let me see if I can craft this Nobelisk now. With steel beams. Did I destroy the... Uh... No, it's right here. Nobelisk detonator, there we go. So now we have the ability to blow stuff up. Do I have any more animal stuff? Because I just realized... Yeah, I screwed up. Not really screwed up, but I have all this to make stuff out of. Okay, I'll put this away. Yeah, we're doing pretty well here. I think next one I'm gonna have to get back out there and start cutting down trees again because eh, I don't want this to run out. And while I'm doing that I'm gonna have to think. I think I want to do some Caterium research as well. Let's see how it goes. Catch you guys in the next one. Bye.